Domestic U.S. D prices recorded a week of simultaneous increases despite the world market still in a downward trend. The U.S. D price in banks continued to increase during the week. For example, Vietcom Bank is currently buying USD by transfer at 24,420 Vietnamese dongs and selling at 24,760 Vietnamese dongs, up VND20 compared to the end of last week. Similarly, Exim Bank is buying USD at 24,440 Vietnamese dongs and selling at 24,770 Vietnamese dongs, up VND10. The free USD price also increased sharply during the week, buying at 25,220 Vietnamese dongs and selling at 25,320 Vietnamese dongs, up VND to 70 compared to the end of last week. The euro price is also still on an upward trend. Specifically, Vietcom Bank bought euros by transfer at 27,033 VND and sold at 28,231 VND, an increase of 51 to 53 VND after a week, similarly. The Japanese yen also increased slightly when Vietcom Bank bought at 165.21 VND and sold at 174.83 VND, an increase of 0.11 VND compared to the end of last week. Despite recording an increase during the week, the domestic USD of VND exchange rate has dropped to a low level. According to many financial experts, in addition to the impact of the world USD price plummeting, the domestic exchange rate is also supported by many factors such as the trade balance and disbursement of foreign direct investment FDI which are still maintaining a fairly positive trend. The world USD price is still on the decline and recorded a month of decline. The USD index fell to 100.11 points, down 0.3 points compared to the end of last week. For example, the Personal Consumption Expenditures PCE price index, the U.S. Federal Reserve's favorite inflation measure, increased 2.2% in August compared to the same period, lower than the 2.3% forecast by experts in the Dow Jones poll. Compared to the previous month, the PCE increased 0.1%, matching the forecast. The Fed has just cut interest rates by 0.5%, the first time the agency has loosened monetary policy since March 2020. Moreover, cutting by 0.5% is also considered a rather unusual move for the Fed, which usually prefers more cautious steps with adjustments of 0.5% each time. At the most recent meeting, Fed members forecast that they will continue to cut interest rates this year and in 2025. This caused the USD price to quickly fall sharply.